ask questions about that. Ask, ask. <laughs> what, what got us here won't get us there, I think is, is the quote. You can feel pretty good about where you are. What got you to that point is not going to keep you at that point. And so you can't rest on your laurels is the way that I interpret that quote. I spent most of my first year school in Downey's Maine. I'm from the Machias area originally. And from there, I just fell in love with education. When I was growing up, I always wanted to be a high school history teacher. Unfortunately, when I graduated with a degree in history, I couldn't find an open position. I took on the educational technician position. I had to go back to school. Immediately, there was a theory into practice. I was sitting in a classroom at night, learning about how the right things to do. And the very next day, I had my own classroom, and I was able to try them out. I thought that was the best darn experience ever, and I've always tried to hang on to that experience around learning by doing. The apprentice program is learning while doing, but also acknowledging that people can't learn while they do with no money. You know, you have to make a living, you have to be able to support family. Providing them a position that's got full pay, full benefits, that allows them to go to a classroom and learn the theory of things, and then go to work the next day and actually practice those things on a day in and day out basis. The other important thing to understand is that with our partnership with SMCC and USM, we've made a commitment that the college tuition for the courses is free to participants. You can enter and exit the Educator Apprentice Program at any time. For example, we have some EdTech ones that have been in our districts for many years, always wanted to get an EdTech 3 certification, didn't know how. This program allows for it and you have an ability to mold those individuals in a way that you know they're gonna be successful and ensure that the work that they're doing is high quality work. And uh, boy, as an employer, I'm not sure I'd want anything more than that. My name is Heather Perry, I'm the superintendent of schools in Gorham, Maine.